May warm up naman yung mga tanong nyo, no? <laughs> Teka, wala may isip. Konting on? May konting ilaw lang. Hello, I'm Art Serrano. I'm an architect and I have a design studio based in Escolta. One word siguro, uh, excited. Parang lagi ako excited about many things. Lalo na sa work ko kasi since nagbibuild ako ng stuff, kahit na hindi ko alam kung paano siya gawin, na-excite ako with the prospect of doing it. Boring pero architecture. <laughs> I guess kasi yun talaga yung line of work ko. But dati hindi talaga ako dapat mag-architect. Hindi ako marunong mag-drawing at all. But over time, na-realize ko na, okay, I think kaya ko pala siyang gawin. And yung impact lang ng ginagawa ng architect sa society, I find it very interesting. Grabe naman. <laughs> happy ako na happy ka. <laughs> Bucket list, maybe just to launch around sa bahay. Wala pa akong bahay, pero I imagine it to be a bungalow. May malaking garden, parang 30% lang yung bahay, tapos grass lang lahat. Tapos may mga apat na asong tumatakbo. Parang gusto ko, like, yun yung image na gusto kong puntaan. Somewhere near a beach. Yung medyo rinig mo yung waves, pero parang pwede ka rin mag-retreat sa bahay lang. Dancing. I feel like hindi ko, hindi ko may imagine sa rili kung sumasayaw. Pero feeling ko parang interesting siyang aralin. Country, I like Taiwan. Kasi maganda yung city building niya. Maganda yung sarap paglakad, sarap magbike. Maraming mga coffee shops around. Very interesting city to, ano, to go around. Ano nga ba? Parang hindi naman ako masyadong nakapag-date. I think. Doon na mental block. <laughs> Pag na-feel ko na hindi kami nagko-connect, I guess, in terms of conversations, I feel like uh, important na nagbabatuhan kayo ng thoughts and da dapat may chemistry yung communication sa akin, kahit first date pa lang. Pag nakita ko na medyo hindi nagko-connect, parang, mm, I think hindi ito mag-workout. Kasi no high school, parang hindi ko talaga alam kung saan ako pupunta. Uh, ang gusto ko talaga math, pero ayaw ng dad ko. Tapos yung nililigawan ko nun, architecture yung gusto niya. Sabay kami nag-fill up sa USD na architecture. And then, biglang surprise, magmamed pala siya. So naiwan ako sa architecture. And then eventually, parang yun nga, na-realize ko na, okay, I think kaya naman pala mag-architecture. Then I stuck with it. I did, uh, mostly because yung experience ko lang talaga ng drawing is yung ano, you know how pagka nag-draw kayo ng bahay, triangle lang, tsaka square. Ganun lang, ganun lang ako dati. But over time, nagkaroon naman ng mga computer-aided tools. So medyo naging skillful ako on that side. I guess my mom, kasi I, I, I like yung hunger niya to provide for everyone and also to like, provide us with a better life. Orchun, uh, local designer sila, malapit lang dito. Mostly mga local local designers. Konting on? <laughs> may konting ilaw lang. I think hard to get. Para may suspense. Do I like myself? <laughs> Joke. Uh, well, uh, what, what I like about myself siguro is ano, parang I'm a man of routine. Uh, I wake up on the same time of day and, and work on the same time of day. And, uh, I usually thrive having something predictable happening. And parang I feel like yung routine na yun keeps me going. Nagugulo yung utak ko pag walang order. May mga parties going around now, like yung mga elephant parties and sado uh, parties. I, I like seeing DJs and musicians play. Kasi parang nat natutuwa ako seeing yung energy nila pouring, creating music there. And then parang, give, uh, parang yung energy na yun taking everyone to places, kahit na nandun lang kayo sabay-sabay. I kind of like seeing that happen. Ngayon, si, yung name niya is Obese Dogma. Since I have a design studio, parang a part of it is I, I treat it as a blessing because of course I'm very happy to be around for almost eight years. But a part of me still thinks that I could have done something else with my life. Parang alam niyo yung everything everywhere all at once. Parang meron kang alternate version of yourself living a different life. I feel like siguro yung alternate version na yun would be maybe in Thailand or in Taiwan or in Japan going around just maybe still a designer but not really fixed with a like physical studio yet parang i feel like hindi ko pa na explore masyado yung mundo and i feel like that i would probably do over that in another life i can not fight this feeling any anytime digo kaya digo kaya maybe tatahimik lang ako lagi ako nagtitimpe so medyo hindi ako magaling magtago ng emotions ko very transparent ako i guess pagka 
Pagka merong nangyari na hindi ko gusto, parang tatahimik ako bigla. Ano ko sobrang dami. Like six espresso shots. I think kasi in my line of work, medyo ano eh, medyo kailangan kong may energy or pagka kausap yung mga tao sa construction and sa ano. I need to be always like alert. Parang naalala ko nung lumindol, I think around 1991 or 2. I, I was really little, pero meron akong very vague memory na nagkakagulo yung mundo. Tapos tip, nagtago ako sa ilalim ng table. Tapos nalalaglag yung mga stuff sa dining table. Merong Starbucks sa may Manila area. Hindi ko sure familiar kayo. Parang it's a bit near Diamond Hotel. Ross Boulevard has very interesting architecture, mostly mga concrete structures. Ang hirap naman yan! <laughs> <laughs> Feeling excited to live a full life with that person. Whatever that full life may be, everything you do as a person, parang slow steps towards that full life. I feel like much of what I do now kind of informs yung aspirations ko about my love for... I, I have a boyfriend, so parang everything that I do is really a slow step to building that life that I... Yung, yung lawn na yun, yung apat na dog sa grass, parang yun yung image na nagtutuloy sa akin lagi. <laughs> okay. Hello, I'm Art Serrano and this is my Slambo.